Welcome to Midlife Mood Taste Test Anniversary Edition. Yeah. What are you looking at? It's just because I'm so short, you can look right over me. Well, you can see here the remnants of our 22nd anniversary. You were so kind and generous and made little uh, the 22 oh, out of heart petals. And OMG, it's 22 like 22 is the greatest year of my life. Oh, Every my day has been perfection. It only feels like 200. Oh my gosh. Well, for those of you who were not at our wedding, we were reminiscing about um, our wedding and there's quite quite an eventful wedding. So on our actual, when we went to go see our wedding venue, it was torn down. Yep. They completely gutted the room we were supposed to get married in. So that was a surprise. Yep. We did get free champagne for everybody though. We got a lot of free stuff. We did get a lot of free stuff. So that was good. If you happen to be planning a wedding right now, just remember things are gonna go wrong. Exactly. It doesn't, it makes for a memorable experience. We're talking about it here 22 years later. It's not the day, it's the life afterward. Exactly. Right, Mabel? Yes. Okay, well for today's anniversary edition, we are going to try some Go Oats. Goats? We, some goats. We have four different flavors of these. I found these it's at the goat. Sprouts. I, I, this just shows you you can't shop in a hurry you actually need to stop and read what you're buying so i'll be honest when i bought these i thought you just like took them out of the fridge and ate them that's not the case you actually have to cook them they're frozen i also thought once you put them on the cookie <laughs> when you put it on the cookie sheet and baked it it would come out flat like a cookie it does not it these are fully baked and they are round oh my gosh <laughs> What does it show on the package? It Why shows it a ball. Flat? I don't know. I don't know. I just thought it would flatten out when I baked it. Wow. Uh, so read the instructions before you buy something. Yeah, press the 23 out. <laughs> I'll let you try this one first. So this is the oh, first one on? here. This is oatmeal in a ball, blueberry flavor. Okay. Uh, macros on this. So serving size is three of these, 170 calories, seven grams of fat, 24 carbs, and four grams of protein. Um, these did take 13 minutes to cook at 400. You can, if they're thawed, they can sit in the refrigerator for a week. Thawed, they only take six to seven minutes. Really good. Really? Yeah, really good. Look, it's kind of cool. Oh, I can't believe that. It's purple on the inside too. I. Uh, this is like the biggest shocker of 22 yeah, years. Yeah, yeah, you marriage. know I'm not a huge fan this of This is oatmeal. shocking, right. shocking. Not a huge fan of oatmeal, but, um, if I was going to eat oatmeal, well, there you go. I would go that route. That's really good. I like it. Mmm. All right, it tastes like blueberry. I love oatmeal. This is good, but what? What's the coating on the outside? I don't know. Looks like falafel balls to me. It does look like falafel balls. This is really good. Yeah. No. Whole milk, steel cut oats, sugar, blueberries. First few ingredients. And it's not. I know you don't like the texture of oatmeal. You have the that texture in the middle, but that crunchy outside. That's what I'm saying. It's, it, it gets rid of it. It's not just the same old runny oatmeal. Ooh, that is really good. Mabel likes it too. Okay, next up we have apple cinnamon. Okay. So these are, um, you can put them in the air fryer or toaster oven as well. Let's see, these are made in Alexandria, Virginia. Apple yeah, Cinnamon, Lindy's former stage name. <laughs> okay. This is outstanding. So we have that going. This, this is, seems like the perfect fall flavor. This is really good. Smells good. Gotta be honest, I kind of love this with ice cream. Mmm. Mm. Oh, I can totally see that with ice cream. Yeah. No, big time, mm. big time fall. Yeah, 100%. Wow, that is really good. These are really good, yeah. Both of these so far. That apple cinnamon. How long cinnamon, did it take to bake? Did you not listen? I just said that. This is what happens after 22 years of marriage, people. Mm. So it took 13 minutes to bake in the oven. Okay. They were frozen, but you can keep them in the fridge thawed and it only takes six Well, what minutes. I'm getting at is like, these are really good. Like, I, I really like it. It's like, but I'm not gonna sit here and like wait 30 minutes or 45 minutes to bake something, right? So it's pretty fast. Do you have to throw it in the oven? 
Yes, or air fryer or toaster oven. Yeah, air fryer, probably, probably less even. Yeah. Um, so here's the brown sugar, which is my favorite. Ice cream. <laughs> yeah, so air fryer six to seven minutes. So. Yeah. All right, what do we got? Next up, everybody's favorite, Ooh. maple brown sugar. The macros on this are exactly the same. Um, just one less gram of total fat. So it doesn't matter what flavor you're getting. If you're tracking your macros or calories, you're going to get about the same three pieces for 170 calories. Ooh, Mabel likes this I mean, one. honestly, I, I feel like I'm eating a pancake. Oh, that's good. Mmm. 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 Oh, this is my favorite. Yeah. I mean, that's like I'm having a pancake. I, there's like, oh my gosh. You can taste the maple in there. Wow, that is so good. Yeah. That is excellent. Where are these guys out of? This is out. This is in Virginia. But I got these at Sprouts. I'm sure they have them in other grocery stores too. But wow, no. That tastes, you're right. It tastes like a waffle, a pancake, something that has syrup on it. Yeah, I'll be honest. This is, this might become an afternoon treat for me. This is, these are this good that they usually, just let everybody know, I rarely eat all this stuff after we're done. Even the popcorn and stuff like that, I just don't eat a bunch of that stuff all the time, daily or whatever and stuff like that. These are that good that I think I would uh, try some of these. We, yeah. might be, we might be polishing this off after that video camera. Yeah, goes. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That, yes, that maple brown sugar was excellent. I'm a, little, I'm a little nervous for finishing on strawberry. I wish we would finish on maple brown sugar. Well, you can go back and have the last bite of the maple brown sugar. So, yes, this has strawberry, uh, same ingredients. It has freeze-dried strawberries are what um, the ingredients are in this one. And um, I was nervous yeah. for no reason. Very good. Very, very good. Maybe even better than the blueberry. Mmm. Stronger, oh, a stronger fruit flavor, I think, with the strawberry compared to the blueberry. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I think it's better than the blueberry. Yeah, I'll give this a label. So, I know sometimes marketing can be tricky and you can't believe everything you read, but these do highlight the fact that they're crispy and crunchy on the outside a hundred percent. Yes, hundred percent agree with this. Yes, um. Definitely. There is a layer. You, you, you can, I mean, pull it up. You can kind of see there is a yeah. layer, and then the oatmeal There's is inside. That, like, it is crispy, and I bet there. it's even crispier in an air fryer. Yes. As long as you rotate them and stuff like that. I think that is going to be really good. Those are great. A huge fan. Now, how, many, how many per serving? Three. For 170 calories. Oh, yeah. So 170 calories for three? That's pretty good. If you, well, I think even if fine. you wanted six, that's still just a little over no i think three would fill me up right the, the, yeah that'd be fine with me six if you want to substitute it for your breakfast or something like that on yeah. the go like you're on the go in the car you want an oatmeal i can't have oatmeal in the car driving slurping away that yes you decide, you decide okay i'll make these and put them in the car and, yeah i could see on the road like getting these baking them grabbing them on the run throwing them in the car and then getting a protein shake to drink down to get your protein in because yeah. this isn't a ton of protein um, it, it's a little bit, but yeah, having a protein shake with that on the go and you're good. This is how much I like them. I'm happy they're not in the airports. Oh, you would eat them, huh? Yeah, I would. Follow your nose like Auntie Anne's. Oh, I was next to that the other day in the airport. So tempting. Still not as good <laughs> as it smells though. Mm, no, it's not. It's good, but it's not as good as it smells. No. Disappointed. All right. I do have okay. a surprise for you, um, that I saw today while I was oh, getting all this stuff. I have an idea coming up that's a themed one as well, oh. too. Yeah. I'll tell you after we get off the air. Okay. Well, I have next week set up and bought already, so let's do it. That's fine. No, it wouldn't be next week. wouldn't be next week anyways. You never contribute. Yep. You never contribute and come up with ideas. That's because I, had, How to, wonderful. I, that's cause I had to wait for your flowers to be done, so I walked around. Okay. Hey, nice. Okay. Well, I can't wait to hear it, so you better stay tuned. Next week, we'll have another breakfast item, and then after that, it will be a surprise. Maybe not the week after, but it will be a surprise. Oh. We'll know when it's mine. Okay. Sounds good. Have a wonderful weekend. Nebraska will probably lose because someone's going to the... Oh, I shouldn't say that. Wow. Nebraska's going to have an upset because you're going to the game this weekend. Dude, this is it. This is where it all starts. Miracle, 
Miracle happening. Michigan's going down. We announce we're back, baby. Okay. You heard it here, folks. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see you next week. Bye. Goodbye.